and I'm here to answer a viewer question I'm actually doing vlogmas this month so I'm just going to use this video as a vlogmas video the question is what is a panto first off panto is abbreviated for pantograph and for me it means some sort of instrument that you can use to trace a drawing and you can even rescale that I remember before I even started doing long arm quilting I used to use my projector and I would trace my quilt patterns off onto a wall and then I could based on and then based on how close or far away from that wall determine the size of the actual pattern that I traced off so if that's kind of a pantograph in its own way as well in my opinion now for quilt making we use it a little bit different we actually buy these paper patterns that are called pantographs and we abbreviate it and call it panto and they come rolled up like this and you can get this to go on the back side of your long arm quilting machine and you buy these and then they have the patterns actually printed onto the white paper how we get this onto our quilt is that most people because it can be done from the front as well but most people lay this onto the back table and then you mark the edges of your quilt top and then you will quilt from the back using a laser light to determine where you are quilting so you're just basically using the laser light to trail on this and i do have a video that i uploaded showing that in an actual video i will try to see if i can find that video either link it up at the eye above or I will see if I can add that clip that also shows the front of the machine quilting as well as me on the back with the laser light following the panto. But I can't remember which video it is. So if I do find it, I will put it right here. Now, as I said, most people use the panto from the back. Your laser light on some models of machines can be also installed on the front, and it can be installed on the front on the gamel. And then some people will just lay this pattern. Uh, say you're doing a block, and you want to put something particular in a block, then they would lay this panto on top of their quilt on to the side of where they're quilting, and then the laser light will tell them where to go, and then they can still quilt, say, block base inside of, you know, block base from the front of the quilt. And I'm sure that there's probably some very creative and crafty quilter who has done the entire panto from the front side of the quilt. But that's it for this viewer request. I hope this answered your question, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye, everybody.